B. Don Magnus has been accused by several local pageant officials across the state of having virtual one-man control of the Miss Texas pageant and which girl wins the crown. Magnus again today denied charges that the pageant was rigged, that he exerts undue influence on the judges, and that he engineered the selection of Shirley Cothran as Miss Texas of 1974. At his news conference today, Magnus denied picking favorites. I know Shirley Cothran, but uh, actually we did very little in her preparation. Uh, all we did for her preparation was her hair and her makeup. Did she sunbathe at your house at all? Uh, yes, she has, but so have several others. Did she babysit with your children at all while uh, you're on vacation? She has, yes. Do you know whether she can sing more than, or rather, can play more than one or two tunes on the flute? Uh, she can, yes. How many more, do you know? I don't know. We've never had a concert, but <laughs> she can play more. I, I can't see how anyone could play any musical instrument and only be able to play one song. Much of the criticism of Magnus came from Richard Guy, the local franchise owner in El Paso. Magnus branded Guy's accusations as lies and said three attorneys have volunteered to file slander suits against Guy, but Magnus says he has no plans to do so at this time. He also said it would be absurd for him to take a lie detector test to prove his innocence, and he does not plan to call a meeting of local franchise owners to discuss the furor. In fact, he said 40 of the 42 local franchise owners he's talked with plan to participate again next year, and he released a telegram today from the Miss America pageant officials renewing the Miss Texas franchise. Doug Fox, Channel 8 News, Fort Worth.